today is the launch of Call of Duty Black Ops 4. I've got the game early and I've got an amazing video for you guys, including my very first free-for-all game on Call of Duty Black Ops 4, the unboxing of the super limited, extra special mystery box version of Call of Duty Black Ops 4. And I'm going to be sharing with you all of my stats so far through the hours of early access that I've gotten on Black Ops 4, all within this video. If you're excited for the return of Ali 8 and Call of Duty, give it a big fat thumbs up and let's see how many we can get for the launch of Black Ops 4. Through my background you may have noticed and may have even seen the unboxing of the Black Ops 1 RCXD, the Black Ops 2 Supply Drop Care Package and I literally went into the garage to find this for you guys because it was behind a load of boxes. This is the Black Ops 3 Juggernaut Edition. I need to work out where I can put it in this room. I've just popped it down there for the moment. So all of those three are now in the background and this thing is huge by the way. The Mystery Box Edition. A big thing Thank you to Activision for sending this my way. So let's get it open, see what's inside, and add it to our background. The box itself is so impressive, it's amazing. So first up, we've got a Voyage of Despair, one of the brand new zombie map posters. We've got a 10 year collection, Call of Duty Jigsaw piece with a thousand pieces. It actually sounds like a pretty hard jigsaw. And guys, the biggest, the most special product within this special edition is a real life, are you ready for this? Mystery box, look at the detail in that. As soon as it was announced, I knew I wanted this and it is so, so special. I believe there's some special gifts inside. I've gotta be so careful with this, it's so delicate. We've got ourselves the game, Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Got a special Zombies Edition hardback cover. Whoa, these are sick. And then a special badge for all of the different specialists within Call of Duty Black Ops 4. These are really cool. But that's not all apparently. We've also got a Zombies comic book, a special edition as well. And then finally, four metal pins of the zombie characters within Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Zombies. Alright guys, you ready for this? Batteries are installed. Everything should work as we open up the mystery box. Ah, the skulls light up, the mystery box lights up, it is so impressive. It's main, meant to make zombie noises, mine's not doing it for some reason, not too sure why, I'll have to look into that later, but it's a brand new addition for our setup. I'll have to work out a more permanent place for it, but for the moment, it's gonna live just there in between my two YouTube packs. <laughs> so guys, this is my progress so far. If we go into multiplayer and take a look at my stats, pretty much everything is on the right hand side over here. I've uh, got a good amount of wins, holding about a 2.4 KD at the moment, but bearing in mind everyone that's got the game is the people that have paid extra money for it, so everyone's pretty good at this stage. The lobbies are definitely a lot harder. Currently ranked 21, put about three hours in so far. Things are looking good. I'm having so much fun, actually more fun in the full game than I did in the beta. I'm actually enjoying this a lot more. The map variation, the weapons, the health, everything is looking so good. Now just before we jump into my very first live game of free for all in Black Ops 4, we've got ourselves brand new specific Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Control Freaks. These are on my controller right now, and for those of you guys that ever ask me what my controller settings are, or what my controller setup is like, I have my control freaks on my controller on any FPS game that I play. These things give you additional height. These have been designed off of the in-game specialist Ruin, who has the weapon Gravity Slam, so these have two height control freaks. As you can see on the left and right, one is slightly higher, and one is a medium control freak. Personally, I prefer the medium height one. These are perfect for blackout, multiplayer, even zombies and you need to get hold of these right now. They're out today guys alongside the launch of Black Ops 4. I'll leave a link down below in the description. If you click that link it'll automatically apply my discount code for 10% off. Each of these control freaks also comes with an in-game Black Ops 4 cooling card specially for these control freaks so even more reason to pick one up. So guys, it is now finally time. This is my first ever time playing Free For All. It was not available within the beta. I'd ranked up a little bit before in TDM to get a nice weapon loadout. And we're on the classic Black Ops multiplayer map, Jungle, but it's been remastered and is available in Black Ops 4, so we couldn't ask for a better map. If you guys go on to enjoy, give it a big fat thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe for even more Black Ops 4 content. Let's jump into action. Let's get a crazy win and let's play some Black Ops 4. This is it, guys. This is what I've been waiting for. It wasn't available in beta, and you know what I'm like. I love 
free for all. It was my go-to mode in Black Ops 3. It's been my, my go-to mode in so many Call of Duty games. And finally, now that the full game is here and the lobbies are actually start starting to fill up a little bit. Let's go, baby. We can go for something crazy. I tweeted out saying I want to get a 30 and 0 game. For those of you guys who remember the road to nuked out in Black Ops 3, where I literally so went flawless with only gun kills. Don't think we'll be trying that quite yet, but we still want something big here, and we're going to go hard. Come on. No! So, so close. We're good, though. We got the UAV on. That's just rude. We've got the UAV, we've got the Hellstorm. Oh, and we've got the Attack Chopper, which is actually a 12 kill streak. It is huge. I'm using the ICR. It's got some really nice attachments on it. Stock, grip, down. reflex sight, and a camo I've unlocked as well. And can we just say, by the way, how good does this game look? I feel like it's brighter. Double kill. Maybe even more colourful than in the beta as well. At least that's what it feels like. There's quite a few remastered maps Fresh on the full version. Oh my gosh! Going live. I'm gonna put my sensor down so I can track people as well. There's one. Oh, I've run out of ammo! I've run out of ammo. I've got a UAV. I've got scavenger on. I need to now be the biggest of sneaky ninjas. And try and... He see me. I need to find a, a, a scav pack from anyone that I've killed so far. Please leave me alone. Someone distract him. Or do something. He's about to get shot in the back. He has no idea. Ooh. May as well pick that up as well. Get myself a sniper. To help me out as well. We're going to be sniping out here as well, guys. It is all happening. Can we get ourselves a cheeky sniper kill? This is the outlaw sniper. Wasn't available in the beta. And you got to say, it looks beautiful. Am I right? Oh my gosh. Let's go, baby. Anything that I can tell you guys in terms of advice is that drop shooting doesn't work in this game unless you've got a specific attachment on. I believe it's stock version 2, which allows you to stay aim down sights as you go prone. Otherwise, it won't let you do that. Um, I'm crouch shooting, so I'm basically going crouch, stand, crouch, stand in the middle of gunfights. Close, close. We tried. Where are you going? You're respawning, baby. Let's go. Or just jumping helps as well. Now, I've never actually used a sniper. It looks a little bit like an intervention from Modern Warfare 2, which can only be a good thing. And we are so, so close right now to our next set of streaks. I'm just going to play this cool, calm, and steady and make ready. sure... Oh, we've got another dart as well. Let's go fire that bad boy out. And make sure that we're picking up this next kill, because this is important. Oh, someone's coming along. What's up, buddy? Let's, Let's go. Down. Cheeky headshot, and that has given us our hellstorm. Another kill. Tracking, tracking darts gone though, unfortunately. We are 160 points away from the attack heli. And that is a 12 kill streak. It's a big bad Ooh, boy. Man, the ICR feels so, so good. Oh my gosh. He could stim. He could get some. We're good though. Doesn't even matter. In comes the attack chopper. Oh my gosh, you guys literally got one HP. That attack chopper finished it off me. Not even mad. Crazy thing is, we are popping off right now. We're looking so good, but someone is still beating us. Let's go! That is what I'm talking about. And we cannot be losing this. Not with the amount of kills we got. Triple kill! Oh my god, that's a quad feed. Triple with the Hellstorm. Final kill being picked up by the attack chopper. This is basically an advanced vision pulse. It's kind of disgusting. A little bit unfair, but you only really get to use it once a game. It doesn't charge up very quickly at all. Close. Attack chopper's gone. We're back to cycling streets. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. This is my biggest streak so far. We're on something crazy right now. We're taking the number one spot as well. 24 to 21. Things are looking real good. Can't lie. I know we haven't moved very much. But if we can get something big right here, we've only died twice. This could be a 30 and 2 entrance opening free for all game. Firing sensor dart. Oh, he's seen me. Doesn't even matter. 
doesn't even matter. We've got the Hellstorm coming in. Who are we going to go for? Let's go for Bush. Oh, got taken out. No, no, he didn't. He just hit. Hellstorm one by. Two more kills. We got this. Right. No! What are we on? What are we on? 28 and 3? Okay, I need two more kills. All I need is two more kills to round this off for a 30 and 3 10 KD free fall game. There were standards that I had back in the day. The heck? Bro, where have you gone? Where are you? Come back here! I don't think so. One kill away. I would consider anything above 30 and 3. 13, 2, and 13, 1, and 0 are, the, are my good scoring free fall games. 10 KDs are above. We're just looking for this final one. I do not want to choke this. I'm going to make sure this happens right now, guys. Oh, hey, Marcus. He's, he's so weak. How? I can't quite finish anyone. Come on. Come on. What do I need to do to get this final kill? If I die right now, I'm going to be so upset. No, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, game. Come on. Let's go. Literally my last bullet in my magazine. 30 kills. Three deaths. A solid 3 KD. For my return to Call of Duty Free Fall, I wouldn't have wanted it any other way. I am so happy, guys. Guys, if you're picking up Black Ops 4 today or just excited for the return of COD, give it a thumbs up. I really hope you've enjoyed. I'll be working on more content, obviously, and playing more multiplayer, more Blackout, and the zombies as well. It's going to be a good year for COD, man. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. You're all the best, and I'll see you soon on another video. Goodbye.